Hello and welcome back to the next episode in the tutorial series, in the quickfire tutorial series. Uh, in this episode we'll be going over prototypes, future future prototypes and their uses. So, the first thing we're going to get into is what is a prototype? A prototype uh, is a technology that you are able to put onto a class design without having to research it. Um, it will it cannot work so you cannot build a prototype to design but you can show it off you can design it and you can future plan it so if i uh go into my class design here i already have prototype so you want to come over here you want to click checkbox and your prototype stuff will show up in here and it will come up as prototype you can then also if we go back into uh this you can click show next tech and you can then click prototype and that will prototype the next tech and that will be called a future prototype uh, and then you can put it on the ship so you can plan out your next generation of ships you can if you just prototype a normal design that will be a normal prototype and it will come up accordingly in the class design window so if we look at prototypes um, if we look at prototypes it should work one second. There you go. Few future prototypes. We have a future prototype, magnetic plasma drive. My current tech is ion drive. And then I can fit that onto a ship just fine, no issues at all. But you cannot tool a ship that has a prototype on it. So the effectiveness and the use of a prototype is to essentially plan out and design your next generation of ships beforehand. You can then further research those prototypes once you have them, uh, once you have the technology. So once I have Magneto Plasma, uh, Magneto Plasma uh, Future Reactor, so I'm going to just quickly SM that in, um, and it should show up if I am correct. So instant Magneto, um, and then. Yeah, I it sh what should be happening here is for the uh, engine to show up, the prototype engine to show up, but you can always just re recreate it normally. Um, I believe there's some kind of bug happening at the moment, or it hasn't been fully implemented yet. But anyway, uh, thank you for watching. Please do like and subscribe. Um, only about 20% of the people who watch these videos do subscribe, uh, and it is really, really important to get the word out there so that more and more people can enjoy more tutorials. Um, I hope you found something useful out of this, um, and if you want to see suggest another another idea for a tutorial please do it in the description below there's a spreadsheet that you can go on and you can enter in the exact uh, suggestion you have accordingly thank you for watching and i'll see you next time